But at the end of the day, I have to be real because, you know, we all start somewhere. We can't just start having everything in good condition. You have the best window ever, the best door ever, the best sink ever, the best countertop ever, the best towels ever, you know. <laughs> yeah, those are my towels. Eyes. Hold on, just let us escape. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Yunis. And if you're a returning subscriber, thanks so much. And thanks so much for watching my videos. Thanks so much for giving them a thumbs up and commenting. So I really appreciate all your love since I started my YouTube channel. Uh, if you've not subscribed also, kindly hit the red subscribe button. And next to it, you will see a bell. Kindly click on it so that you may always get notifications anytime I upload a new video. Once you click the bell, I assure you that you won't miss on any video that I upload because you will always get notifications, but that is if your data is on, you know, so thank you so much. And today we have a topic that I'm sure you will relate if you are a small YouTuber, even if you are a YouTuber who has really grown in this industry of YouTube, you will somehow relate because you were once a small YouTuber, right? Yeah, you once started somewhere, so I'm sure you will relate. So I want to air out what kind of challenges as a small YouTuber um, passed through. Okay, it's not maybe, it may not even be all of us because we are not the same. But personally, I experienced many challenges while doing this YouTube thing, okay? There are so many challenges that I passed through. Sometimes I feel like giving up. Uh, but I just have to keep going because, you know, we all start somewhere for us to reach where we want. We have to achieve the goals. But before we achieve those goals, you have to start somewhere. You have to struggle. You have to do everything. You have to put on all the kind of effort you have to so that you may reach or you may achieve your goals. Okay, so here are some of the challenges that i passed through and maybe you also passed through i hope you can relate and if you relate kindly don't forget to comment in the comment section so that i may stop feeling as if it's only me maybe who is passing through all this or maybe it's you know don't forget to comment just let's give each other hope okay so guys here are some of the challenges that i personally go through Challenge number one is quality cameras or quality videos. You know, when once you have a quality camera or a good camera, definitely you will put out quality videos, which personally, I don't have a good a good camera or a... Yeah, because... Yeah, my, I'm sure mm, my videos are not in bad conditions because they all get views and no one complains about the, about the quality of the video. But personally, I know it's not in the best quality once I compare my videos with other YouTubers' videos, which I should not definitely compare because at the end of the day, I don't have any other choice. I have to put out content despite not having a good camera. So quality videos is one of my challenges that I go through as a small YouTuber. Another challenge is identification of viewer-specific content. Now here comes the biggest challenge, guys. You know, trying to identify what kind of content you will put out so that you may get more views or more subscribers, it's not easy. You try and maybe try to, like, you try to compare what kind of content should I put out maybe this week because you want views, you, you want views, you want subscribers. You want to maybe YouTube to to recommend you in other people's channel pages, you know, but you are not sure what kind of content will bring you to that. Guys, that is not easy. We are always, okay, personally, I'm always confused. I don't know about you. If you feel the same, kindly don't forget to share with us in the comment section so that I may stop feeling as if these challenges are, are just I'm the only one who is passing through that kind of challenge, okay? So guys, another struggle that I personally go through is maintaining consistency. Maybe some of you may relate because, you know, we also have other things to do. And also trying to find content or what kind of content to put out 
it may interfere with your consistency okay because personally i was like what kind of content should i put out it's already wednesday it's here it's on thursday it's already sunday i don't have content so that will interfere with your consistency so that is the kind of challenge that i also passed through another struggle is financial challenges hi you know sometimes you want to do videos that require maybe some that require you to finance them like for example travel vlogs or restaurant review vlogs definitely you need some money you need money maybe to go and order food so that you can know what kind of food they have what kind of like facilities do they offer travel vlogs you need that transportation fee maybe if you want to do a vlog maybe if you want to do a vlog uh, in mombasa you know you need that transport if you don't come from mombasa or maybe if you're from nairobi or if you're maybe from nakuru you need the money or the transportation fee so that you can go to mombasa but so that is a struggle personally i find it a struggle because there are so many videos i would like i would love to do but financial issues just come my way which i don't have to struggle <laughs> anymore because you just have to be yourself if you can't afford anything you just can't you can't force yourself to afford it you can't go and steal money so that you can do a certain video another challenge that i go through is running out of video ideas of course this is a very it's a i don't know it's if you go through that kind of challenge because personally there are some days that i don't have ideas on what um, to vlog about because especially this time of quarantine or this time that you we are just indoors like you just can't go somewhere anyhow you have to vlog maybe indoors or if you have to go out you have to be careful i don't know you have to do what so it's becoming a challenge it's really becoming a challenge you've done maybe apartment tour you've done clean with me you've done closet organization you've done a uh, pantry organization guys it's not easy to get ideas especially in this time of lockdown it's not easy i don't know if you can relate if you can relate kindly comment in the comments section because it will help me be sane maybe you know i'm trying to think kai or maybe i was not meant to be a youtuber because i'm running out of ideas i'm really running out of ideas i'm trying to think of any idea that i would put out even next week but i don't have ideas so kindly comment in the comment section also if you want me to do a certain video that i'm capable of doing kindly comment so that i may see if maybe i'm capable of doing that kind of video i will definitely do it but if i'm not capable you'll just have to understand okay so guys another challenge that i go through is marketing marketing my videos or my is it videos yeah my videos and my channel is a challenge because everywhere you go you have to be like hey i'm a youtuber i have a channel kindly subscribe you you have to leave them a link and also don't forget to watch my videos please also ensure you you like them and you comment like everywhere you have to go you just have to say that okay it's not a big deal but you know maybe you don't know what kind of person you're going to confront maybe you don't know how they will react also market marketing them on social media on your social media platforms definitely that is easy but you know every time you keep checking oh have they commented or oh, maybe you're like hey guys check out my new video i just uploaded a new video kindly check out my new video so you're like oh i hope you go back to your youtube videos and you're like have they checked it have they clicked on it have they commented have they liked like it's there is that feeling i don't know if you get that feeling because personally i'm like every time you're just on youtube trying to see if your video has views or if your video has likes it's just a struggle youtube is a struggle guys it's really a struggle 
and you may even feel like giving up but at the end of the day we we ain't giving up we ain't another challenge guys that i personally go through is okay i don't know how you say this one or maybe i'm the only one who encounters this kind of situation should i say it let me just tell you guys subscriber decrease it's just sudden decrease in subscriber count guys like maybe today i have 400 subscribers when i wake up in the morning the number has decreased it's 398 where are my two subscribers now where have they gone seriously 400 to 398 you know those two subscribers mean a lot but unfortunately when i wake up in the morning two have gone i don't know they have unsubscribed or what happens it really feels bad you know there is that motivation you get once you see that you are in 399 subscribers and when you wake up the next morning or maybe the next day you see you have 402 subscribers three more subscribers that is a big change and it really motivates us small youtubers yeah lights are gone the lights are gone the lights are gone i don't know let's just finish this so the last okay it may not be the last but i have to finish here the last kind of struggle that i passed through of which this is not a big issue for me maybe some youtubers may feel it's a struggle for them but personally yeah it used to be a struggle but for now i'm used to it so the struggle is being real and being real you know it may sound funny but being real is a struggle it's a challenge because you want to maybe you want to vlog in your house on or in your room but you are afraid oh my god my background looks weird what am i going to do you start finding white sheets to cover your background maybe as you can see my background it's the door the window the sink you can see right and you see my curtains are not in good condition even the curtains holder they're just they're not good but at the end of the day i have to be real because you know we all start somewhere we can't just start having everything in good condition you have the best window ever the best door ever the best sink ever the best countertop ever the best towels ever you know <laughs> yeah those are my towels so guys you can't just start like that okay but i'm sure it's only the minority who starts like in the best way but majority we all start somewhere right even the biggest youtuber you know Hmm? or the most popular youtuber you know maybe they started somewhere right but being real is a struggle personally i'm real everything as you can everything you can see uh at my background that's mine and i am proud of my house i'm proud of everything my curtains you know once i get money i will definitely decorate my background and maybe you We'll see a big change okay guys so if you can relate to all my struggles kindly don't forget to comment in the comment section just share with us so that we can we can build each other we can give each other hope you know some some day we will be somewhere so don't forget to comment just comment and tell me hey by the way Eunice we I can relate like maybe being real is a is a is a struggle for me also maintaining consistency is a struggle marketing my videos is a struggle just don't forget to comment okay so thanks so much for watching this video i appreciate your support i appreciate all your your prayers for those who pray for me you know so if you've not subscribed kindly do so like my videos comment and we will see each other or we will meet in the next video so bye